Brown here for Irish Football Fan TV. I'm joined by St. Pat's manager Stephen McDonald following their 1 0 defeat to Waterford here in Richmond Park on the opening night of the 2020 League of Ireland Premier Division. Stephen, disappointing result, but still plenty of positives taken from an encouraging second half performance. Yeah, um, you know, first half I thought we sort of played the occasion rather than the match. First game of the seasons are always uh, helter skelter. I thought we felt we could have showed a bit more quality and composure on the ball in the first half. And then, you know, we conceded such a such a sloppy goal at the start of the second half. But after that, the response the response was quite good, and you know, we missed a lot of chances, and uh, their keepers pulled off a couple of brilliant saves. Seven Edmonton's on the pitch tonight, so it will always take a while for this team to kind of gel and kind of click as quickly as it would like. Yeah, definitely, it was always going to be an issue, but I felt we had a good pre-season and. Uh, the players that I've signed have settled in really well, so um, you know we were coming. I was coming here uh, expecting a good performance, a little bit disappointed with the first half. Second half a bit more like us, but ultimately it's disappointing, you know, um, getting beat uh, at home in the first game of the season. I felt maybe a little bit hard done by ten minutes in the second half when Roy Free went down the box and wasn't given a penalty. Yeah, I felt it was a blatant penalty. I think everyone in the stand, I think, judging by the order for the reactions, they weren't accusing Rory of diving or that. So. Um, you know, I felt that the referee was the only person in the ground that, that didn't think it was a penalty. So, you know, but they're not accountable really. They don't, they don't, they don't. You know, it, it, it's probably cost us an equaliser, but nothing. You know, it doesn't really make a difference to it. He suffered a little bit of a setback before the game with Dar- Dara Markey was down to start. Obviously, went off in the warm up. What's the update on him so far? Yeah, I just felt his Achilles um, in the warm up. He, he made a movement in the warm up and felt a sharp pain as Achilles and. You know, he was struggling to run, so that wasn't ideal. Obviously, you have your preparation done, but these things happen in football players. It's not the first time a player's got injured in the warm up, so you just have to adapt. Off now, next week's the showgrounds play Tiger Rovers. Obviously, always going to be a fixture to add a little bit of spice with St. Pat's because Liam Buckley, obviously, being their manager. Yeah, look, uh, that, that makes no difference. That's neither here nor there. We want to win our next league game. We particularly want to bounce back after after tonight's defeat, so that's, that's going to be the main focus in our minds. Stephen, thanks very much for joining us.